Welcome back to Movie World Recaps. Today, I am going to share an action, comedy, romance film about a couple who is about to be wed. The movie starts on a resort island in the Philippines. Darcy Rivera and Tom Fowler's wedding brings together family and friends. Darcy goes to a dinner where she sees her mother, Renata, who doesn't like the big wedding. Tom is planning a surprise for Darcy on a motorboat when he is startled by a security guard and falls into the water. Carol, Tom's mother, and Larry, her second husband, show up. At the same time, Darcy's father Robert shows up with his new younger girlfriend Harriet, which bothers Renata because she still hates Robert after they got divorced. When Darcy and Tom try to spend time together, Tom's best friend and best man Ricky pulls him away, leaving Darcy with her younger sister Jamie. Darcy's charming ex-boyfriend Sean, who was invited by Robert, shows up and makes things worse. He calls Darcy D.D., and everyone can see that his presence makes Tom nervous, because he is jealous. Tom gives a speech, but Sean's more personal speech, to Darcy, steals the show. Then Tom's sister Jeannie, gives a speech about her recent marriage problems. Darcy and Tom try to relax and get close, but Carol comes in and says things she thinks are encouraging, but aren't. The two end up sleeping in different rooms. The wedding is the next morning. While the couple's wedding website is being set up, a group of pirates is making their way to the island. Renata, Jamie, and Carol help Darcy get into her dress, but she feels like something is wrong. She sends Tom a text message to meet privately, and Darcy says that having everyone come to the Philippines for their wedding was too much, since she never wanted a big wedding. They argue until they decide to call off the wedding. Just then, pirates attack the resort and take the staff and guests hostage. When Tom sees this, he runs to tell Darcy. Because they know Robert is rich, the pirates force everyone into a pool and demand a $45 million ransom from him. Darcy is in her room, but Tom gets her out and tells her what's going on. When they see an armed pirate trying to get in, they try to think of a way to catch him. Tom wants to catch him in a net, and Darcy thinks that spraying his eyes with hairspray will do the trick. However, they are both taken down and tied together while they try to stop him. The pirates then take the couple to their leader, but Darcy asks for a cigarette and uses it to set fire to the pirates' heads, making them jump out of the cart and leaving the couple to try to take control of the cart on their own. They manage to jump out, but Darcy's dress gets caught and is mostly torn off as the cart falls off a cliff. Then, one of the pirates attacks them, but Darcy pulls a grenade out of his hand, and Tom kicks him, making him fall against a rock and kill himself. He feels terrible about killing a person. Darcy and Tom try to find a way to get free, but Tom warns Darcy to be careful with the grenade she's holding, because it doesn't have a pin, and dropping it could set it off. They try to find a place with good cell reception, so they can call for help, but more pirates chase them, and Darcy drops the phone. They find a tower with a zip line and use it to get down. Darcy drops the grenade on two pirates, and when it blows up, the others know where they are. When the couple lands, they are scared to see that their loved ones are being held as hostages. They try to find a way to get help. The couple goes to the kitchen to figure out how to get out of their binds. Just as they cut themselves free with a deli slicer, a woman pirate comes in, but Tom gets a nasty cut on his hand that makes Darcy faint. Tom fights the pirate until he knocks her out by throwing her through a window. When Darcy comes to her senses, she shortens her dress and puts on boots so she can help Tom save their family members. Darcy and Tom find the resort's main office, but there's no internet there. Margie and Ace, who own the bunker, hide the couple there. While she is taking care of Tom's wound, Margie says that the resort was attacked by pirates the summer before. Tom already knew this. Darcy yells at Tom about this, as well as his tendency to hurt himself and his feelings of insecurity, which led him to plan the big wedding. Tom responds by saying that Darcy is acting confident when she is really scared. Tom then takes care of the hostages, since he brought them all there in the first place. When another pirate gets close, Ace and Margie send the couple down a tunnel. However, Tom gets out and turns himself in, so Ace and Margie can only catch him. Darcy stays hidden. Tom is taken to the other prisoners. He says something in Balinese that means fuck your grandpa, and then he puts a knife to Sean's throat. Sean had said that phrase before, and Tom knew that the pirates were Balinese, so he figured Sean was the bad guy who hired the pirates. He even shows an invitation to a wedding that one of the pirates had. 
Tom says that Sean had hoped that Robert would pay the ransom since Robert didn't give Sean any money to invest. Sean stops pretending and gets away. He joins the pirates and points a gun at Tom. While staying with Ace and Margie, Darcy starts to feel bad about her fight with Tom, so Ace and Margie tell her to save everyone herself. Sean uses Harriet as collateral and takes her with him in his helicopter when he goes to find Darcy with the head pirate. When Darcy shows up with a gun, he tries to make up with Tom before fighting the pirates. Darcy and the other hostages are taken by the pirates. One of the pirates wants to kill Darcy because she burned his face. The others then find out that Harriet was in on the plan the whole time because Larry was recording everything and caught her and Sean making out on camera. Harriet kills the leader of the pirates while they are in the helicopter. She hits him in a pressure point, which makes him stop moving, and then throws him out of the helicopter. Darcy and Tom come up with a plan to get married in the pool, which the pirates let them do. Before the couple decides to fight back, Carol gets everyone to sing the song I'll Be, with Carol getting her hands on a rifle too. They kill the pirates with another grenade, which sets off fireworks that wake Sean and Harriet up. While Darcy and Tom try to stop the bad guys, Ace and Margie help the guests get to safety. When they get to the docks, they beat up a young pirate and try to steal the motorboat that Tom had planned to use to surprise Darcy. Sean finds them and tries to get Darcy to join his side, but she doesn't want to. She and Tom get in the boat, and Sean stays on the shore to go after them. Harriet is in the helicopter and tries to shoot at them. Tom and Sean get caught in a flying parasail as Darcy speeds up the boat. Tom uses a piece of fake hair to zip line down, and Darcy uses a cake knife that Carol gave her to cut the parasail. Sean is cut up by the helicopter's blades and Harriet falls into the ocean when the helicopter crashes. In the last scene, Darcy and Tom make it back to the island, where they are able to fully forgive each other and agree to keep their wedding plans. The police show up to catch the pirates who are still alive, and Darcy and Tom finally get married. The last firework went off by accident when Jamie and Ricky were making out. I hope you like our movie recap for today. Please subscribe to our channel for more content like this and hit the like button to help us out. Also, tell us if you want us to recap your favorite movie in the comment section below. Until then.